well. Uh, this just occurred on stream. I just finished my Twitch stream. Every once in a while on Twitch, uh, we'll watch some ridiculous uh, cooking product infomercials. They get started looking at the Kathy Mitchell micro crisp videos. Kathy Mitchell, I don't know if she's like from something or what. A saleswoman uh, has been peddling BS as seen on TV kitchen products for decades they all stink the long ones are fun when it's like a long you know like it's like a instead of a show on tv it's like this hour-long thing trying to promote a pan or whatever but found this playlist of kathy mitchell infomercials like it's just a commercial like one or two minutes long you know the copper pan i think it like steams eggs or whatever i don't know but uh yeah watching them went so well i thought it would be worth sharing in a kind of compiled form so this was from a stream but it's cut down a little bit for your enjoyment uh so if you think i am funny when i have things to say about what i'm watching and just complaining in general you'd probably enjoy it and i'm sure we'll be watching more over on twitch.tv slash willow davis and by the way let me give you the usual live stream language warning can i recommend a two minute kathy mitchell video sure eat this book you love delicious hot meals, but recipes can be time-consuming and complicated. What are you doing? That is, I will say, that is me in the kitchen on nights where I'm, like, cooking something for myself and also making a different dinner for Jamie and also trying to feed Holly and also trying to, like, empty the dishwasher so I can load it back up with dirty stuff. Yeah, she's talking shit about cookbooks when... <laughs> she made a lot of cookbook. Um, yeah. Oh my god. When I'm when I on nights where I'm making the giant pot of soup, it's crazy. And what a mess you're left to clean. But imagine if you could make but dinner I hear it's with really no good. pots and pans. Hi, Kathy Mitchell here with Eat This Book, my new collection of recipes that you prepare and cook. On a oh my god. What's what is this, some fucking parchment paper? What is it? A, it's like the fucking what is it? An Applebee's kids menu? What is this shit? The fucking local diners advertisements. From the book, it's dinner made easy. No. Just tear out a page and put the ingredients right on the pic. Why would I do that? Why? How about a fucking scale? How about a measuring cup? It's that easy. What am? What is this for? A cooking baby? Then fold and bake for a delicious meal every time. Guaranteed. Why am I eating the it out of the book? Baked ziti with meatballs and mozzarella. Who's meatballs? Parchment paper pages are a foolproof way to make the perfect meal every day. Where did the meatballs come from? How am I supposed to not fucking know how to make pasta and meatballs? You just put them together. Hey, no more messy pans to clean. Finished? Just toss it in the trash. Here's a simple salmon recipe. Add some asparagus. Why? Why? with ranch dressing and lemons then fold crimp and bake zesty ranch salmon so delicious or choose another page start with boneless chicken thighs then fill the spaces in with the book peas and ham it's like coloring with food oh my god Emberlyn would fucking love this you're right cover with cream of chicken soup and oh. grated swiss cheese oh then your eyes on oh now god comfort food. it's the bokussi oh my god it's disgusting Without measuring <laughs> fill the pictures and your recipes will turn out why does she make a time. trough it really is mistake proof and fun no 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 this is stew fill the pictures and your recipes will turn out perfect every don't, why are the kids handling the raw meat? It really is mistake proof and fun for the whole family. And don't forget dessert. Watch. Fill the page with your favorite Why desserts, would I do that? And make a crumble with ginger snaps and butter. Spread over the top and bake. Then reveal a sweet surprise. Wow, imagine. As inside. Wow. Call now to get Eat What's This the Book point with of 50 the pages fucking of book? recipes for $14.99. But wait. Order now and we'll send you another 50 pages free. That's enough for 100 dinners. And this offer keeps getting better. Call right now and you can get a second full book. Just pay separate fee. That's 200 pages of recipes. Enough for 200 dinners. 
I need to see a video of someone actually making this. Don't think it would turn out like they're showing. Eat this book, fourteen ninety nine. Order now. Eat this. Call one eight hundred three two six twenty six zero four. That's one eight hundred three two six twenty six. Yeah, why is it doing so that? So Call or visit by eatthisbook.com. So call one eight hundred three two six twenty six zero four. Order now. Eat eat this bussy duck. <laughs> Don't go to that site. Um. Oh, there's a playlist. Not the micro. You love again. delicious hot meals, but. Everybody loves delicious tacos, but fried shells are full of fat and hard to fill. Who fucking cares? Actually, you know, I don't like a hard shell taco. It doesn't make any fucking sense. Just eat the filling with chips or something. I can't stand that. But not anymore. People <laughs> making things that don't make sense to actually eat in the real world. Kathy Mitchell in the kitchen with my amazing quick taco. The places right. where this shit comes from don't have this problem. Because they'll just take a fucking tortilla and, like, grab the stuff, and then it's, that's their thing. This ingenious tray makes it easy to make crispy, delicious taco shells in minutes. Watch. Just put tortillas on the nonstick rack and bake. The secret is Quick crispy. Taco's unique design that enhances airflow around the pan. Now you have perfect taco shells in less than five minutes without all the fat and mess. Oh, yeah. Could just use the oven rack, yeah. Flip them over and fill with the good stuff. Then use it as a serving rack for the whole family. Everyone who tries it loves it. The, the obsession with handheld food is too much. Just have a little cup with the things in it. From simple beef or chicken tacos, fresh seafood, or even this delicious loaded fajita. But it's not- How's that a fucking fajita? Just for tortillas. Here's one of my favorites. Just flatten some canned biscuits and pop them in the oven. Biscuits? Then fill the baked pockets with steak, onions, and cheese, and back in the oven. Why don't I just eat a fucking biscuit, Kathy? For a delicious melted cheesesteak. Or add pizza sauce and pepperoni for a double meat pizza pie. Why don't I just eat a fucking pizza, Kathy? God, look at this. Okay. The possibilities are endless. From buttery breakfast filled biscuits to dessert. <laughs> what, is it? What, do I need the, what do I need the device for? Why don't I just make that? Watch this. A little butter and sugar, and you'll bake up the flakiest dessert shells ever. Fill them with anything. Ice cream, fruit, or both. Who could resist? Why don't I just lay it flat and then put it at the bottom? It's my Baja banana split. How, why is it Baja? Or this chocolate delight. Crispy shell with marshmallows, caramel, chocolate, and that's so yummy. The you entire rack s'mores. is nonstick and dishwasher safe. You can get the quick taco today for only $14.99. And right. I'll include my recipe book filled with scrumptious recipes. Oh, thank God. But wait, you also get four clip and dips. This, I know this is going to make me mad. What's a clip and dip? Now you can clip your salsa or sour cream right to any plate. Why? For who? In case I'm running a marathon with a plate of tacos? Wait, or serve your favorite sauce or cream with dessert. And we're not done yet. Call right now and you can double your order. That's right, you can get two quick tacos and eight clip and dips a huge $60 value for $14.99. Call now. 3D print this. I can't keep it. Oh my god. Ooh, I fucking. Now this is recent. This is currently relevant because people are still buying the fucking copper pans. My new red copper five minute chef. You're going to love the way this it's kitchen bullshit. wonder makes delicious home cooked food in a flash. Making stops working in like a month. Omelets in a fry pan is time consuming a year and such tops. a mess. We'll try this. Place in sausage, peppers, egg and cheese. Then close the lid. No folding, no flipping. And in just four minutes, a delicious, light and fluffy omelet. Designed with two deep wells, Five Minute Chef cooks from the Why top. Why would I not want to flip an omelet? And bottom. So Five Street Street, Carly was little. Look at that. My homemade corn dogs are done fast. It's not a corn dog. You made you made corn. You made loaf. You made corny wiener loaf. I don't know. Fast and easy. Not fucking corn dog, Kathy. You made cornbread and shoved your wieners in it. fruit pies in minutes. Infused with pure copper What's and wrong thanks with to the oven? scratch technology, it re- Ah, oh, yes. Biscuits. Brown on all sides. Is this the toughest part? You know how, how much you love the bottom of the biscuit? Now the whole thing's the bottom of the biscuit. Punishment. Five Minute Chef is faster than takeout. Look, the meltiest, cheesiest pizza ever. You can't do that in a round pan. And no sticking. Everything comes right out. Five Minute Chef is... At first... ...is smaller than a toaster and cooks beef or pork... What's the biggest toaster I've seen in my Everything fucking life? right out. Five Minute Chef... 
this? What the fuck is that contraption? Oh my god. Jesus Christ. Oh. Jeff is smaller. You could bake a fucking loaf of bread in that toaster. This <laughs> toaster sis. Than a toaster and cooks beef or pork moist and juicy while cutting cooking time in half. Even makes stuffed fried chicken with no fuss. And when you crave a quick dessert, stir up a little cake mix and fill in the well. No. And if you're gonna make cake mix, just put it in the fucking oven at that point. Cookies or candy and close the lid. In just minutes, this chocolate lover's dream. With five minute chef, there's never a mess. Just a at first. Quick wipe and it's clean. Yeah, you can't put it in the dishwasher though. Sierra sirloin, fry hash browns, bake biscuits faster than preheating. Hash brown, not a bad idea. In an oven, cook perfect sunny side up eggs, then flip it over for over easy. That was easy. Hi, Kathy Mitchell here in the kitchen with the incredible new flat fold colander. And the name says it all. It opens to strain and folds flat for easy storage. It's the colander that's large enough to strain a big pot of pasta, but folds down small enough that you can store it anywhere. And it even saves space in the dishwasher. Trying to strain with a pot and lid can be an accident. That's not going to get clean. You just closed it. Anywhere. And it even saves space in the dishwasher. And it holds in all the, all the, all the pasta residue, too. Dishwasher. Trying to strain with a pot and lid can be an accident waiting to happen. Well, yeah, you lazy bitch. Don't do that. Use a strainer. Watch. The flat fold collar <laughs> drains quickly, and the pour spout allows me to move the food without losing a single piece. Just look at how much space ordinary colanders take up. Who's that thing made of? Pewter? You're gonna die. Without losing a single piece. Just look at how much space ordinary... Grandma's colander over here. You could fit that in there, actually. Just go upside down. Go, go like, uh, go like that over the thermos. What are we doing with the thermos, really? What are we holding onto the thermos for? Very colanders take up. You can fit flat fold colanders into the same space. Other colanders sit low in the sink, so the water actually backs up. That's why it's got little feet inside. But the flat fold colander. Ew. You think I'm just accepting that there's just sink water getting all up in my pasta? Stands tall. So whether you're washing, rinsing, straining, or draining, the water stays away from the food. The flat fold colander is large. It's not and my fault you bought the shittiest colander of all time. Five pounds of potatoes. The easy grip handles make it easy to lift and it won't tip over. Use it for straining pastas or steamed vegetables or easily. Looks flimsy. I don't know. Clean a giant head of romaine lettuce. It's dishwasher safe. And remember, the flat fold colander stores thin enough. You can slide it away into any small space. I now like to take convenient. it to the garden when I gather fresh vegetables and then right into the sink to rinse them off. And you know, you can even prep and toss a family sized salad in the flat fold colander. And Why would I do that? The best part of that no more soggy salads. And when you're done, just snap it closed and tuck it away out of the way. Pick up your flat fold colander to we don't take measures to avoid standing sink water touching today. Through, yeah. Hi, Kathy Mitchell. My, my train's backing up and it's getting all in my fucking spaghetti. My new red copper egg chef. You're gonna love the way this magic machine cooks delicious omelets, hard boiled eggs, and lots more in a flash. Boiling eggs can be a mystery. Are Why is it a mystery? Are they done or not? Back when I did, back when I made eggs a lot, I'd always say, if you're not sure if they're done, just wait a little bit longer. What's gonna happen? Is it gonna be too hard boiled? Like, as long as you don't forget for like over half an hour, it'll be fine. It'll explode after that, but. Who knows? Well, Egg Chef does. Just place eggs in water here. Add the lid and press the button. That's it. In just. I know this thing's just gonna be harboring mildew and mold. Minutes, soft, medium, or hard boiled eggs. Is this Scottish eggs? Cooked to perfection. There's no guesswork. It automatically shuts off and beats. My in-laws gift this kind of shit for Christmas. It's dreadful. I'm telling them. Keeps the second your you eggs are that. done. It's smart and fast. And look, when they're cooked right, be, be the grateful. shells slide off with ease. Add this insert, and now it's an omelet cook. Give my fucking steamed omelet. Toss yeah. in your favorite ingredients to make mile high western omelets. Mile high. Mile high western Bacon, omelet. cheddar, and chives. Even use egg whites. Easy to I'm make. I'm showing this to the French, and we're, you're going to be in big trouble. It can taste great. You can even make quick scrambled eggs for breakfast burritos or over easy without ever touching a fry pan. Crack two eggs into the split tray, and you've got perfectly poached eggs for Eggs Benedict and That's hardly more. Poached. The secret? A unique thermal sensor that guarantees guarantees excellent results every time. Now enjoy fresh- Yeah, what appliance has a thermal sensor these days? The, our, 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 the unique thing about our device is it knows how hot it is. 
egg salad sandwiches, scrumptious deviled egg. No, it was, oh, this was supposed to be hollandaise? The, no, that's just gotta be fucking mayo, right? <laughs> Dick and more. The secret? A unique thermal. My grandkids refuse to eat any food that isn't shaped by a mold. Sensor that guarantees egg. It's gotta be Kawhi. Excellent results. Hey, my, yeah, you missed Big Lee. Nothing, nothing good happened. Every time. Now enjoy fresh egg salad sandwiches. This thing makes a sandwich? Scrumptious deviled eggs for a protein packed snack. I think the devil's in more than just those eggs. Plus, its compact design stores away with ease. Egg Chef also makes the best steamed vegetables. That's the emo. It, was, it, it, it being so fucking blurry adds to it, too. Just look at that color and wait till you taste these zucchini noodles in a stir fry. The possibility. Oh my god, what's the point? If you're making a fucking stir fry, but these are endless. To have some real Stop noodles. Stop stressing and guessing with your eggs. <laughs> Taking the egg out. Is this done? Is this done? Order my new red copper egg chef for only $19.99. Plus, get my eggs and more recipe book free. If red copper ever fails, we'll replace it guaranteed. Call now and receive the omelet insert and the poached egg tray, both free. And here's something to get egg excited about. You can double the offer and receive a second set. Just and why would I want that? Pay a separate fee. And in you can get a second one, just pay for it? Is that what she's saying? You can get a second one if you buy it. I did that. You can double the offer and receive a second set. Just pay a separate fee. Okay. An incredible <laughs> value. Call now. Call 1-800-690-4010. That's 1-800-690-4010. Call or visit by eggchef.com. So call... Separate shipping and handling? Or maybe... 800 Yeah, it's probably something slightly less, but... Order now. Oh my god, you. ...by eggchef.com. So call 1-800-690-40... What are we doing with that? That's fucked up. ...ten. What? Why? What is that? What is that, a French toast stick? Order now. The dump diet. Creating time-saving cookbooks <laughs> is my life. And taste Hopefully it's high in fiber. Testing hey. recipes is part of the job. So keeping my weight down is a struggle. That's why I created... <laughs> Sounds like a personal problem. <laughs> I don't fucking care. ...of diet. All new delicious <laughs> low-calorie dump recipes. I've dropped 25 pounds, and now you can too. It's so easy. Just dump, bake, and lose weight. Here's a light lasagna. Dump ricotta, egg... Oh my... Oh my god. Who's gonna if you're gonna if you're gonna have a lasagna, what's the point? You're gonna make a light lasagna. Just eat something else. You, what are you how, how are you gonna take away from a lasagna? Substitute and seasoning in a bowl. Then layer with a meaty pasta sauce and zucchini strips. That's right, zucchini. A great low carb replacement for pasta. Oh, you, you just made shitty fucking ratatouille. I don't know. Finish with the ricotta mixture and mozzarella cheese. <laughs> then bake. Best lasagna ever and only 200 calories. No, that's, that's fucking zucchini parm. What a fun dinner. Bake tortillas on an upside down muffin tray. That's fun. Dump in chicken, pinto beans, and taco sauce. Then top it off for my Chick-O-Lite taco bowl. Yum. Or look here. Start with chicken and brown rice. Add fresh broccoli and broccoli cheese soup. Sprinkle with cheese and bake. So easy. But Kathy, what device am I going to be making all these in? A tasty filling meal without all the calories. Want my personal diet secret? It's this magic soup. Only 65 calories and so good. The secret to my diet is I eat fucking nothing. 65 calorie soup? That's fucking water. Good. God. Eat the fucking broth alone. If you had a like cup of fucking broth, it's probably And mashed potatoes with half the calories. And every diet needs dessert. Try my chocolate raspberry trifle. Is that all for me? With angel food cake, chocolate pudding, fresh raspberries, and whipped topping. A sinful dessert, only 140 calories. Now I can eat the foods that I love and still lose weight. Kathy's guilt-free pina colada cake is so easy to make, and it's my favorite. So dump. I don't trust this goddamn thing Kathy says. Bake and Look lose weight with my dump diet cookbook for just ten dollars. But wait, call now and you can get 100 calorie snacks. Just pay separate fee. Cravings between meals? Try these scrumptious chocolate nut butter bites, quick quesadillas, or berries and cream. You can get dump diets with over 160 recipes plus 100 calorie snacks for just. She's she's really banking on you not having internet access. Ten dollars. Call now. Tired of brownies that stick to the pan? 
No, actually. They always crumble, making your family grumble. Fuck, I, my, kids, my kids fucking terrorize me. Every, I try to, I give them a plate of brownies. Hum, I humbly beg for their approval with my plate of crumbly brownies, and they, <laughs> they tell me they hate me and want to live with dad. <laughs> Well, I've got the solution. Hi, Kathy Mitchell here with my new red topper brownie bonanza. This is not your regular old baking pan. Everything slides right out. Even A fucking sheet of parchment paper. A drop of oil, please. And my sticky marshmallow treats. Watch how easy. Just pour in batter, insert this brownie grid, and pop it in the oven. Wow, 18 loaded fudge brownies already sliced. How nice. Now place your brownies on this stand and you've got an instant serving tray. Perfect for parties, picnics, or backyard barbecues. And if you love those edges, tray. Perfect for parties, picnics, or backyard barbecues. And if you love those edges, his brownie bonanza bakes each piece separately. Are you guys a, a edge of the tray? You guys like a corner brownie? See, Jamie would hate this. She loves a middle piece. So every bite of my s'mores brownies are chewy outside and gooey inside. Stuff them, stack them, or frost them. It's truly a brownie Stuff bonanza. Em. And thanks to Red Copper Nonstick Ceramic, your brownies never stick. I like a side piece, you know? I like I like a bit of the crunch. So you never scrub. Try cheesecake, red velvet, or cookie dough brownies. Your family will go bananas. Bananas? Try <laughs> Man, we came, a, we came a long way from the dump diet, huh? That too. But don't stop there. Layer pie crust, filling, and cake mix. Then drizzle with butter for my famous apple pie dump cake. Perfectly cut and ready to serve. And it keeps getting better. The kids will devour these pizza bites or biscuits. I don't understand the use case here. And sliders with brownie bananas. Those fucking sliders. What the fuck? How are we doing Bands sliders? This seems awesome. so much less convenient. These are endless. Plus, it's dishwasher safe. Okay. You love delicious oh. hot meals, but recipes Eat this book. Bug. When it's time to strain, it can be Ooh. such a pain. You fucking dumbass. You splash Fool. and spill in your pot. Pastas down the drain. Well, I've got a better way. <laughs> Hi, Kathy Mitchell here with my new red copper bed. Yeah, are all these <laughs> else is low quality. Better pasta pot. The tempered glass lid doubles as a strainer. Why Never seen that shit before. But I thought, I oh my god, and she was just selling a fucking strainer, saying you can't you can't strain the the pasta with the pot lid large five quart pot has these easy lock handles just lift and they automatically lock that looks like a safety hazard then drain the water out and keep the pasta in with my lift and lock handles you're guaranteed the lids on tight perfect for spaghetti night not even pounds of potatoes can unlock this lid infused with pure copper and thanks it's scaring the locks are scaring me Joanna's they're too powerful scratch technology it re anti-scratch technology is this the and toughest and and punishment and look, it's slippery nonstick ceramic. Every oh, that's perfect for when I need to slosh searing hot melted red hots at my enemies. Everything comes right out. Not even my cheesy chili mac. Imagine that touches your skin. Stick so you never scrub. Better pasta pot is easier to use than flipping on a light switch. I highly doubt that. Want to know a chef's secret? Simmer chicken bones and veggie scraps for a rich homemade broth that's... Chef's secret? Isn't that just how you make fucking broth? Not even my cheesy chili mac Liquid cheese. gold for savory soups and sauces. The durable lid has large holes for draining delicate ravioli and small for tiny vegetables or brown beef and easily drain the grease. Okay, look out. Oh my god, fresh jalapenos, Kathy? Add my special ingredients and you've got prize-winning chili. Cook, drain, and serve a mountain of peel and eat shrimp. Oh, Without imagine the smell. Try this. Melt sticky chocolate, butterscotch, peanut butter. What? What is it? Oh my god, what are you fucking high? What is Is this for King Cobra? Peanut butter chips, chocolate chips, and potato chips? Butter and cornflakes. Pour oh, cor <laughs> cornflakes. Out and let cool wow, that looks like... Fucking manure. Cool for these delicious haystack treats. Oh, yum. Whether it's. <laughs> hey, Shay with the Prime sub. Thanks so much. Appreciate 42 months. It's a lot of months. Shay 206 just subscribed with Prime. 42. Jesus Christ. I thought you were an atheist, Shay. Uh, thanks so much for the 42 months, Shay. Let me see some sandwiches in the chat. Uh, Zach, speaking of dog shit, how's Poe doing? Whether it's a dozen boiled eggs or a bushel of corn, just lift and lock and you'll get a safe and steady pour like never before. 
Dinner Whoa. can take hours to make, and who has the time? Dump dinners. Dump dinners are here. Hi, Kathy Mitchell here with my new dump. <laughs> are these supposed to make you shit, or does this, is, or does this fat in your ass? Dinner cookbook. Now just dump and bake for full meals in minutes. So delicious. Look at these smothered pork chops. Easy cheesy tacos. Roasted chicken with potatoes. Oh, he's better good. The best pan pizza ever. Full meals in oh, minutes. See that pan pizza. So delicious. Look at these smothered pork chops. Easy cheesy tacos. What the fuck are you doing? How am I supposed to eat this? A knife? Roasted chicken with potatoes or this? The best pan pizza. Looks like shit. Get a cast iron, lazy. Ever. Cut up some biscuits in a skillet. Dump on tomato sauce. Your what is it, a fucking pull apart pizza? Your favorite toppings and cover with cheese. I'm showing <laughs> this to the Italians. You bake for a delicious it's pizza over stuff for with you. all the goodies. Yum. Here's my favorite comfort food dinner. Start with chicken and mixed veggies. Add a can of creamy chicken soup, a few chunks of Velveeta cheese, and top with a can of crescent rolls. Just look at this. A cheesy chicken pot pie with perfect flaky crust. And what do I need you for? How about a new twist on meatloaf? I dumped ground beef. Oh, I'll show you a twist on meatloaf. Stuffing mix, an onion soup pack, and water into this bag. Then just mashed it all together. Now just cut off the corner and squeeze into muffin cups. After Why? Why are we fucking basting the meatloaf in? On meatloaf. I dumped ground beef, stuffing mix. What's the fucking bag for? An onion soup pack and water into this bag. Then just mashed it all together. Now just cut off the corner and squeeze into muffin cups. After Why? I don't understand the fucking bag. Baking top with mashed potatoes. What's being advertised? I think a recipe book for dump dinners. A perfect portion in each muffin. You'll love it. Get great shortcuts. <laughs> a meatloaf muffin. Too. Like this beefy pasta. No need to Sounds like some shit keto people would actually do. Yeah, you're probably right. Those keto freaks. The pre-brown meat or boil pasta. Dump it all in the pot. Oh, is that cheat? I thought it was rice. Pot. Like. Dinner is served in 15 minutes. Yeah. Yeah, that's how I would make minutes. that. What's what, what are you selling me? I'll try this shortcut, Ravi. Keto people would not have mashed potatoes? I think that they'd find a way. Yoli lasagna. Dump frozen Ravi. Some mashed ca cauliflower or something. Yoli's on tomato sauce. Add fresh spinach and cheese. Layer as high as you like for steamy, melty, home-style lasagna. After work, I never want to spend time making dinner. What can we do about that? Now, I just dump everything in and bake. Well, see, the problem is you go to work. To make you the you just chili not. mac and cheese. Stop slaving over dinner. Make delicious meals in a flash with dump dinners just $10. But wait, call now and you can get my best-selling dump cake cookbook. Just dump and bake. I feel like these are all self-explanatory. I don't know what the book is for. For the scrumptious rasin peach dump cake. Or rasin? Use canned biscuits to make fresh, warm, sticky buns Mrs. just Butters like worth. grandma used Ooh. to make. You can get dump dinners and dump cake. You just, that was like fucking store-bought biscuits and fucking syrup. What, what am I buying? It's for $10 with over 250 delicious homemade recipes. Here's how to order. I guess this part's supposed to be filled in with how to order. Tired of food getting stuck to your pan? No, I don't know. Sick of Oh, now this is the fucking thing. This is the one. This is the one that everyone got and was just like, oh, it doesn't stick. Raping and scrubbing? Yeah. And when your meal won't fit, you just want to quit. Well, I've got the solution. Hi, Kathy Mitchell here with my new that Red Popper the book, Square yeah. Dance. This fucking thing. A lot of people got this. Man, this is not your... I bet it doesn't still work. I bet it's not doesn't not stick no anymore. No scratches equals no sticking. Everything dances right off. The square we got to have a lesson in the hardness scale because... It's just not how that works. Your design means you can fit more bacon or more burgers perfectly. And the high sides prevent grease from spilling out. Non-stick and no scratches. Try this. Dump in tape. That's perfect for when I burn one small candy cane in the middle of my pan by accident. Tots, then add cheese, any breakfast meat, and cover with eggs. Top it with biscuits and pop it in the oven. Yes, it's oven safe up to 500 degrees. And look, everything Only you 500. want for breakfast and no extra pans to clean. Even make 16 sliders at once. You can't do that in a round pan. Infused with pure copper and thanks to anti-scratch technology, it resists the and toughest what, what, punishment. Don't do that. Don't do that to the pan. Why are you using the pan as a mixing bowl? Pearl cheesecake into brownie mix with a metal fork and create... Don't do that. Don't do that. Create this delicious dessert. Even a bacon crust Hawaiian pizza. 
Even if it wasn't gonna fuck up the pan, you'd just be fucking up the fork then. It slides right out. Love pancakes? Here's a tw I do love pancakes. On occasion. If I got nothing going on that day. Rick, drop a little water in the pan. When it dances, you know it's hot and ready to cook. Like these ooey gooey chocolate That's just pancakes. how you make pancakes. No sticking ever. Square Dance works on any stovetop, even induction. Square Dance? Oh, it's leftovers? called the Square Dance. tortillas. Yeah. Add meat, beans, and cheese. Fold like this. Top with lettuce, tomato, sour cream, and salsa. Salsa? Try my Square Dance. Salsa? But the acids. Pan and you'll be dancing all day. Plus, it's dishwasher it's safe. Put your eyes on these homemade dishes and chocolatey desserts. Oh, God, what is ramen joy? It's all made it's like almond joy. With ramen noodles. Really? Ramen noodles? Yes, ramen. Hi, Kathy Mitchell here with my new Ramen Joy cookbook filled with unbelievable recipes. Kathy's a big fan of appropriation. <laughs> Everyone will love. <laughs> This entire basket cost under ten dollars, and wait till you see what you can make with it. I love Costco. Check these out: ramen shrimp, ramen tacos, even ramen sliders. Watch. <laughs> Vegans will never stop, will they? This brown some beef or any other meat with a ramen seasoning. It's just pack. like shrimp. Dump in a package of ramen, a good size square to catch. All right, come on. Now you're stealing from what's anti fee, or was it was it anti fee or anti fee? Chip and a can of cola. Hold on, I'm hearing you out. I'm going to hear you out here. Go on. Watch this. Brown some beef or any other meat with a okay. ramen seasoning pack. Dump in a package of... Season it with the ramen packet. Ramen. Put in the crunched up ramen. Good size squirt of ketchup. Squirt of ketchup. Good size squirt. And a can of cola. Yes, cola. For a fantastic... Cola? Barbecue beef pasta better than what they serve. Yeah, I'll do it. Yeah, I'll do it. Yeah, I'll try it. With the rib joint at... Kathy was really the OG to what these YouTube moms are out here doing in 2024. Uh, where do you think they got the ideas from? Yeah. They all bought these products. At a fraction of the cost. What more? Form cooked ramen and egg into a fast pizza crust. Now, okay, she's onto something with this one, but she's definitely not the inventor of it. Years ago, I remember hearing of a uh, ramen ramen buns for a burger. Form it, form it into it. You need like a little, you need little pans or something to shape it. Fry it up, fry the ramen up into a little, little bun put a burger on. Then add your favorite toppings for a mouth-watering pizza in minutes. It's right here. I don't know about minutes. On page 84. And here's my favorite. Just dump some ramen on top of some leftover chicken and veggies. Add a can of soup, stir and bake. A That's just reverse of like what people actually do for like ramen. Just feast for the they usually put some stuff in it. Family, all for less than three dollars. What the best salad ever? Start with lettuce, onions, and mandarin. Ramen croutons and oranges top with crushed ramen and pecans and use your seasoning pack to make an awesome dress a restaurant best ramen seasoning dressing seller you can easily make at home Ooh, love that brunch how about these decadent truffles or grandma's ramen apple pie you ever have ritz apple pie i could i see it i could see it i could see it mm -mm. ramen pie i could i'd do it yeah i'd have that I love these recipes. I made the creamy berry crumble. It was fast. Is the ramen the crumble? Easy and so delicious. So amaze everyone with my new Ramen Joy cookbook. Just $10. But wait, you can also get ramen nibbles with my favorite party recipes. Like these Just whip up some streusel. These cheesy jalapeno poppers or this fresh ramen hummus. And don't... Wauma, are you here? Are you here? Party recipes like these cheesy jalapeno. It's the future of hummus. Poppers or this fresh ramen hummus, and don't forget dessert, chocolate. Mousse. Amazing! I'll take it. Filled ramen cups, yummy! You can get both books with nearly 100 delicious ramen recipes for ten dollars. Here's how to order. Call one eight hundred three eight three six sixty to get ramen. What do you do to make it? What do you do to make the ramen hummus? Blender? A special TV offer, but you must call now or go to www.byramenjoy.com. So call 1 800 383 7660. That's 1 800 383 7660. Call now. When your fry pan's too small, cooking slows to a crawl. That's why you need my brand new big time pan from Red Gopher. Whoa. Bigger is better. Look, over 50% more space to said. cook everything call at once number. instead of in shifts. Now feed the family faster. The square design means you can fit up to nine burgers, a boatload of shrimp. 
over 20 chicken tenders perfectly. The high sides prevent grease from splattering your stove top. Big Time is non-stick ceramic, so everything wipes clean. Try this. Add biscuit mix, milk, canned peaches, and brown sugar. Top with blueberries and pop it in the oven. Yes, it's oven safe up to 500 degrees. And look, you're serving grandma's peach cobbler. Enough for a big. family reunion. Even makes... Kathy, studies suggest some, some women actually prefer a smaller... Copper 16 pan. cheesy enchiladas at once. That's impossible in a round pan. Infuse Don't. I 16 cheesy enchiladas at once. Enchiladas? That's impossible. Call, that's what we're calling that in a round pan infused with pure copper big time is anti-scratch and nothing sticks now saute three pounds of beef vegetables gravy and top with dough to make this hearty beef pot pie that will feed the whole team i must use a pie tin big time is the perfect pizza pan watch lay in pizza dough. it's no it's not oh add cheese in the crust and top with everybody's favorite fixes okay no that kind of makes sense that kind of makes sense i feel like it would work better with a round pan though Wow, big enough to make four personal pizzas all at once. Yum. Big Time Pan works on any stovetop, even induction. Go ahead, sear, bake, fry, even roast, induction? and serve. Big or small, it does it all. Good cooks deserve great pans. So step up to the big time. Smaller. I would just get one that's not going to expire. Pans with low sides cost nine. Steel, stainless steel, cast iron, never have to buy it again. Sounds pretty good to me. $50, but call now and get my red copper big time pan for just twenty nine ninety nine. dollars get I got this. My mom was getting rid of some uh, pans and stuff. She was getting rid of fucking everything because I guess they're like moving soon or something. I don't know. Um, giant stainless steel. These like fucking high walls. Really thick on the bottom so it holds heat well and i'll never need another pan like that again because it's just gonna recipe book free if you're not completely satisfied return for a full refund guaranteed but wait you could double the offer and receive a second set just pay a separate fee bigger is better an incredible value call now call 1-800-214-4039 that's 1-800-214-4039 or visit bigtimepan.com so call 1-800-214-4039 Order now. Pumpkin pecan pie. Creepy pumpkin tart. Pumpkin Warm paradise pumpkin. book. She, again, she's really banking on people not having the internet. Nut bread. Everybody loves pumpkin. And now making these is so easy with my new cookbook. Everybody loves pumpkin. Pumpkin paradise. Favorite pumpkin recipes you can make it. Kathy's like, I'm going to fucking cash in on these fall bitches with their fucking lattes. Home in minutes. What? Mix canned pumpkin, sweet milk, and butter in a bowl with an egg. Pour the whole yep, mixture that's, into a store crust. That's how you make bake. pumpkin pie. Add pecans, sugar, and butter, then bake again. This is no ordinary pie. It's my insanely delicious pecan pumpkin pie. Or start your day right with my light, fluffy pumpkin, pumpkin pancakes. pancakes. Drizzled with hot apple cider syrup. How about Hot apple cider donuts? syrup. Yum. These recipes are all in my book. Even my grandma's pumpkin cranberry bread. It's also bread. on Google. Combine yellow cake mix and eggs with pumpkin, pumpkin and molasses. Pumpkin palooza. Add some cranberries pumpkin and paradise. bake. Be sure to get a warm slice right out of the oven. Want a hearty dinner? That's not Try recommended. Pumpkin baked ziti. And start with I do like a nice pumpkin pasta sauce. My roasted red pepper and pumpkin soup. So easy. Dump pumpkin, roasted red pepper, chicken stock, celery and onions. Slow all down. In the blender. Heat it up and add some cream. You'll have the best soup ever. Perfect to warm you up on a cold day. I bet Here's I could do better. Favorite. Make it in the oven or even in your slow cooker. Just beat sugar, butter, and eggs. Add the pumpkin. <laughs> slow cooker owners begging to get some kind of use out of it. And dry ingredients. And it's already in the pot, so you're done. Just turn up Slow the cooker and <laughs> owners on this. want I so bad to have a use for that thing. Melt in your mouth. These recipes are amazing. I made maple pumpkin cookies and these cute pumpkin cheesecakes for a party. Everyone loved them. That's Get not my cheesecake. New pumpkin Paradise today for just $10 with more than 100 spectacular pumpkin recipes. But wait. Call now and you can get a second book for family or friends. Just pay separate fee. Here's What's with the order. anime profile Call picture? Call 1-800-608-1510 to get your delicious Pumpkin Paradise book. Call now or go to PumpkinParadiseBook.com. Pumpkin Paradise. So call 1-800-608-1510. That's 1-800-608-1510. This offer is not available in any store. Call or We're on now. number 13 of 45 Hi, in this playlist. Hi, Kathy Mitchell with my new Red Copper Express. Gonna have to cut this off at some point. Gonna love the way this kitchen wonder makes delicious home... Oh, we saw this one already. Christmas dump cakes. I got it. We'll, we'll end it. We'll end it off 
at the end of the Making year. With the holidays can be a frustrating, time-consuming task. And I should know, with a big family and long hours in the kitchen. My stupid well, fucking big family always makes me cook for them. Here is the solution. My Dump Cakes cookbook, filled with quick, easy, and delicious holiday recipes. So yummy. It's so love, simple. Love, love going to mom's for, uh, you know, her to throw three or four store-bought ingredients into a pan. Oh, just dump and bake for the best cakes ever. Here's my holiday Makes fruit the cake. trip Start worth with it. cherry pie filling and canned fruit cocktail. Dump on a chocolate cake mix and pour on a cherry cola. That's oh. it. Just- <laughs> now we're talking. Ooh. Just bake for a warm holiday cake all your guests will love. So delicious. Ooh. Well, whip up these festive layer bars. Watch how easy. Mel- Looks Burn. Some butter and sprinkle on some graham cracker crumbs. Add sweetened condensed graham milk, coconut, crumbs. rice krispies, chocolate chips, and M&M's. And look, you'll love it. Big Perfect dig for dig a holiday dig. party. Overnight guests, treat them to this Christmas. Now I like that. Christmas tree coffee cake. Start with butter and syrup. She did that without even looking. <laughs> she right. knows what she's doing. Overnight guests, look at that. Treat them to- Look at her just squirting that in there. That looking. Christmas tree coffee cake. Start with butter and syrup, then layer on a tube of biscuits. In minutes, you'll have fresh, warm breakfast cake. Oh, I love that. Really good. That looks pretty fucking good. Really goodness. And get rave reviews on this pumpkin pecan dessert. Easier than pie. Pumpkin paradise. With no crust to roll out. How about these brownies with a peppermint twist? I feel like it's just brownies with... with- crushed up peppermint on it. Can't forget old St. Nick. Here's my favorite. Combine fresh raspberries and... Razzleberry champagne cake? I'm listening. Jello. Forget soda. Jello? Bring on the champagne. Dump on some white cake mix. We're getting oh, crunk wow. this Just Christmas. Look. Make any occasion a celebration. So don't stress during the holidays. Get my... Mama, mama. Make any occasion a celebration. Well, maybe you get off so the don't... fucking phone dress during the holidays get my dump cake cookbook with delicious holiday recipes for just ten dollars but look wait. at the kids to help out call now and you can get my amazing dump dinner cookbook with easy dump meals dinner like my- dump dinner's back a deeply delicious pizza or my hearty beef and pasta dump dish dump Bounce dish beef, dump in uncooked pasta and sauce topped with cheese and cook perfect for the busy holiday season you can get both cookbooks dump cakes and dump dinners for just ten dollars with over 250 simple delicious holiday recipes wow here's how to order what a deal 1-800-4290 simple delicious what a deal that's 1-800-4290 what a goddamn deal huh we'll have to save we'll have to save uh the fucking 30 more for another time.